Ooh, not far off from stopping the bomb plant with that incendiary. Christian is going to get caught advancing through the smoke. Frozen's done the same, though. He's on that bomb train now. He could try and contest. They're going to push together. Voxic's oh. going up the ladder, and he's got so much damage done. It's frozen. Ice in his veins. Three frags to his name. Kenny, however, standing his ground. 2v2. Bomb down and in favor of G2. Frozen on the ladder. Oh! That's insane. Excuse me, I'm sorry about that. That's a bit much. <laughs> You're going to have an ace on the agenda here. And Nexa, he'll be behind E-Box. Full Diffuse certainly available. Frozen's going to have to go for it. And now we will see if Nexa oh. can convert the spray. Looks like he's done enough here. Frozen's still on for the ace. He's running out of time. He's he has to go for the full defuse. He jumps up again. Is oh, it going to be enough? Good. It's good. It. Has he got it? Be close. I think he's done it. The ace clutch from Frozen. Oh. Oh, I can't believe oh, it. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry for anybody listening with headphones. <laughs> my ears did explode yeah. a little bit. I've got to set the maximum volume over here. Yeah, and that's just, an uh, involuntary a sound. Uh, tunnel. Affirmative. What have you run for, right? Yeah. Rambo oh, Nice. Flashing, flashing behind you. Don't sit you, don't sit you on. I'm watching City from flat. Expecting the flash as he ends up just getting humiliated. Staring at the wall, Kenny. He's looking oh, for more, and what? this is phenomenal stuff. Holding the wolf from the door with an orb of all weapons. If he finds another one, man, I th I, he's, he's already gone above and beyond. Flashes. Looks like he wants some more. Rops is on those close boxes. He does drop in, and Kenny. He's doing it all! Oh, oh, it's Kenny, yes, on. baby! Never forget the name! Four kills, he finds G2 the ninth by four. Oh, look. Like it. Oh. Ah. He's blinded. Nice, man. <laughs> AV behind six. Nice bait. Yeah, he must be with our pack. Of course, of course. Oh my god. Peace. I should build up with this, yeah. I should join around with this. This is why I need to be in Astralis, man. Look at this. Yeah, yeah, drop me AK. Bro, did you see the Zipnix? Only because of me, man. Okay, I'm jumping down. Only because of me, this happened. Man, as I thought. Taylor, they're able to rotate back around and make G2 look a little bit silly with their over rotation. So, yeah. oh, look at this buy from Chris J as well. He could have afforded uh, absolutely everything to go for him. Quick run, boost, and perfect. Hello. Oh, 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 like that to see is those ones. so satisfying to watch. Well, Ross. I, I was going to mention they've got down by the doors right now. He has ramp control, but he doesn't have control of the situation. Bested by Barupt. Horace will hear decon swing wide open. Besides that, for now, the Prioritization will be towards Ramp, goes in, bangs through the door, gets the kill onto Cadian, peeks out no. with the orb as well. The second as he picks up the frag onto Barupt, he just needs to deny the defuse and waste a little bit of time. A fantastic flurry of frags from Forrest no. as he wins the round, causing mass atrocities. At the sandbags and still see their head, it's quite an impressive find from Taco, all the same. Oh, Art, oh, that is quite the announcement. He goes for the AK with oh. style, and now Yuri's filled the feed as well we've seen many of these rounds better to them kng down to 16 taco and fallen around 50 so a four and four still huge advantage for furia yeah and i think that nade damage in the death is enough for them to start moving away from it and caserato his push is so perfectly timed he can call banana clear he's actually chosen to smoke it so he won't have that information readily available and that information is delivered oh. and deleted henny holds down the trigger and finds all three Beautiful. That's what we like. Vixe. Cara, eu vou falar, velho. O Fallen tá de AW, mano. O Fallen tá de AW, tá ligado? Tira um Fallen de posição. Nossa, o Taquinho morreu. Quatro? Quatro kills.
Temos para o professor. Presente aí, professor. 4 kills no round, 400 de dano. É brincadeira, hein, mano? Olha essa bala agora, ó. Ó. Que isso, velho? Tá, papai. Aí, que isso, mano? Que isso? Fala, hein? Ele acerta o Vini, vem. Essa é a caixa do Michel, hein, velho? Aquela ali, ele tava na caixa do Michel. Fala, hein? Pega a primeira kill. E aí vem. Caralho, trocação sincera. O Taco, o Caio, o Henrique também. São quatro jogadores. Mano, é, é muito. É câmera da morte, nervosa, 1x1. Yuri versus Fer. Reload pra ambos os lados. Os pistoleiros aí do Velho Oeste. Tá aí. Nossa, mano. Que isso? Yuri. Rivalidade. He can go for the wall bang though. Caserato's low that would actually take him down. Does he want to take that shot? He's looking towards the cold zero area. And he gets the first kill. Like I said, a wall bang would be enough. He go pulls on. the trigger there. That could be it. Oh. He's going for it. And now he needs to know where he is. Oh. Amazing effort there from Fall. And this game really is starting to warm up now. Every round's coming down to the wire. This time it will be Furia to break the spell of MIPR. Good gracious me, that was epic. I thought he had it, man. Lovely game. This one is case of rata. Jsem, jsem se chtěl opravit, protože jinak hráli velmi sofistikovaně a opatrně. Teď ale tohle to poslední kolo tak už opravdu šli bez flashe, bez ničeho. Jenom naběhli na site. Ukončit ten zápas pravděpodobně co nejrychleji. No, tak očividně i to dva V4. se dá použít. Ze 2V4 máme 2V2, twist stále nemění zbraň, mimochodem. Co se tady ale přichází dozad, tady si myslím, že Experience nemusel být připraven a taky, že nebude, co se pro sebe získává zbraně, ale twist je tady blízko. <laughs> dokonce, no, no scope. A tady je záska. Auto sniper, takže, už to nemůže být horší, a ty se stále tu zbraně nechává. Ale hlavně pokud to my omysne, tak on je mrt, on za to opravdu zaplatí, to nemá šanci přežít, on musí trefit, otázka je, jak si to twist pohlídá, twist je zaskoupová na, na konektor. To mi tam. It's fucking insane how many viewers this cowless guy has, man. Man, he's casting my BR game, especially now I might be our Furia. Man. Jesus Christ! He has like m almost double more than all the streams together on HLTV. It's fucking insane. Foxy's got Jax locked in. He loves his flash setups. He's pushing on this. Catches Jackson, oh. gets the shot. Voxic, stunning. Unfortunately for him, though, his teammates bait the corner. If he gets this one as well, these moves! Oh. If he gets this one on one, this round, it could be his. But no scope, he's just gambling. He's just throwing his money in the lottery and he's doing it twice. I, I, I've, I've lost words, I've lost oh, logic. My God. VP have probably lost this map. Yeah, probably. I think being the key word there. I, I Čau, čau. Čau, čau, slyšíme se? No, ano, ano. Tak já v první řadě tady pogratuluju k výhře. A... No, děkuji vám. Co na to říkáte na ten zápas? Měli jste to, nebo když se vezmeme tu druhou mapu, train asi o tom se nemusíme úplně bavit, protože tam jste byli úplně někde jinde. No, na Dustu jste začali perfektně, ale potom to bylo jako vypuštění. Jak, jak byste to tak nějak cítili na tým speaku? Šo. Jak, jak, jak to bylo 1 na 4, tak náhoda byla úplně parádná. 2 na 4, vyhráli jsme pištolky a všechno vlastně skončilo tím, jak jsme prohrali jeden Force, protože jsme se nedohodli, jeden hráč má držet long, nestalo se, Force si dostal tilt, začal ho lákat, <laughs> víc dostal tilt, začal ho lákat, z 2 na 5, 2 na 12, dali jsme taktickou pauzu, já, nevím, já jsem ho lákal ty minuty, aby se spamatali a nějak jsme vyhráli. Asi tak bych to zkrátka jako, no, doklepal. Nevím, byla to asi náročná mapa, co jsme zahrali, si myslím osobně, ale. Nevím, jak jsme to vyhráli, no tak to povím. Myslím si, že Defeater se zahodili, lebo to jsme vyhrát, že to nemali. Cestu na Ačko. To znamená, že by si z toho mohl udělat také jedna, ve, jedna situaci. Ono, flipy ani palmy na tom nemají, co se životu týče, úplně na rozdávání. Tady ale nakonec odkrává krásně hráče, ale je to palmy, který zabíjí Zera. No a vzhledem k tomu, že má asi tak 40 sekund defuse bombu, tak to bez problémů zvládne. A my máme dobojováno 16-3 a naprostá demolice ze strany týmu Rams. Já jsem šokován.
ten banán, kde přichází i rotace ze strany Luka. Ty Estuba už očekává ten ačkový tek, protože vidíme LV, který má za to celé info na tom shortu. Akorát neočekává, že by to všechno mohlo být taháno přes long. Teď už tam začínají padat ale ty granáty a tady je Luka připravený, dostává dobrý flash, ale zároveň získává dobrý kill. Kapti tak tam získává první, získává i druhý. Tam ještě přišel perfektní molotov na ten výběh a Luko stále přežívá, sice se 14 životy, ale přežívá, teď ještě pouští spray, pechin umírá tež. Tohle je triple kill pro Luka. No a myslím si... ...tu čím, olí avancada hrši, hrši de CT, pogers. Eli sabe, eli sabe. Forest will hit the econ, swing wide open, besides that for now the... Prioritization will be towards Ramp, goes in, bangs through the door, gets the kill onto Kadian, peeks out no. with the orb as well, the second as he picks up the frag onto Barupt, he just needs to deny the defuse and waste a little bit of time. A fantastic flurry of frags from Forrest no. as he wins the round, causing mass atrocity snobs. What have we just witnessed there, Jack? A very difficult round to recover, but it looks like they're absolutely fine here. It's gonna oh. be a three on two. Oh, oh, here we go, we're back into it now. We're going to see whether they get the bomb planted. Look how far away they are. We've got Yuri and Henny. Still, huge advantage for Furia. Yeah, and I think that nade damage and the death is enough for them to start moving away from it. And Keiserato, his push is so perfectly timed. He can call Banana Clear. He's actually chosen to smoke it, so he won't have that information readily available. And that information is delivered oh. and deleted. Henny holds down the trigger and finds all three. Beautiful. That's what we like. And it has to be the eco now for MIBR. 2-1, and the loss bonus only had $1,900. So here's a replay in case you missed it. You heard the screaming, you run back to your TV, and this is what it's all about. And they go up and get absolutely dealt with by Henny there. So we will see MIBR with just the Glocks. No armor, no nades, no real money invested. We've got KNG on the P2. But the bomb has gone planted for VP, and now they're going to try and get aggressive, regain some map control. Flamey was waiting for exactly that. Sanji does find success, and Jame with the orb could post up towards the spawn, but he's been caught on the cross, tagged down. Flamey coming for the coffins. Jame has to hit the shot, and he does, but he's got three more to find. Yeah, Jame has a lot on his shoulders here at the coffins, and he just dodges oh. that shot from Simple. Not enough. Mm. On the second time around, and a defuse will come in for Na'Vi, but Jame gets that close, makes that very, very uncomfortable for the Na'Vi side. Simple v Jame is such a sick matchup, and the reason really being is because these are players that play for the clutches. These are players that play for the end of the round, right? You're not going to see Jame being the first dude in, running up mid and dying in 20 seconds. Like, this guy is always playing for either the save or the clutch, and he gives it a good go every time. Now, Simple shuts him down in the one-on-one, -on -one, but James certainly makes things look interesting, and VP, they're going to... Ooh, he even gets an extra kill too. Freiburg, two overzealous. As soon as that smoke goes down as well, it's such a tight choke point. There's no point trying to run the risk of charge through. You're just going to get sprayed down and slaughtered. That they hold their ground for the meantime and start to rethink this one. They back up. They're going to go through secret again, up towards ground level. Keep themselves grounded in the round. They've still got 50 seconds. They don't have to rush things. They can take a nice slow approach to it and get right. He might have the winning approach. If he tucks in here towards squeaky snods, he could really make some noise. Ooh, comes down to timing. The Natals are making their way down towards B. Get right, spots up, bar up. Down he goes, the forest is towards heaven as well. Oh, they could really do damage here. Get right with another kill. They're already outside heaven towards A. Look at this rotation coming up from Nico. He's walking straight to three crosshairs. Oh, oh and get right ends it too. Get right with 11 the ace. To four. What's this? listening with headphones my ears did explode yeah. a little bit i've got to set the maximum volume over here yeah and that's just, an I, involuntary I, I sound my brain yep i'd like to apologize <laughs> thanks very much frozen though the first two were lovely picking up the third as Aminet gets the bomb down that advantage lasted for a moment but Look this that. is just nonsense getting the fourth and even tidying it up with the diffuse in the last second 21 kills to eight as he makes sure that g2's comeback is nothing but a dream Beautiful stuff from Frozen. 15 to 5, G2 will cross it. See how he handles it, and he was expecting the flash as he ends up just getting 
humiliated. Staring at the wall, Kenny. He's looking oh, for more, and what? this is phenomenal stuff. Holding the wolf from the door with an orb of all weapons. If he finds another one, man. I th I, he's, he's already gone above and beyond. Flashes. Looks like he wants some more. Rops is on those close boxes. He does drop in, and Kenny, he's doing it. Oh, oh it's Kenny. Yes, on. baby. Never forget the name. Four kills. He finds G2 the ninth by force. Beautiful stuff from Kenny. Two players survive here, and that's going to be back-to-back -back rounds for them. Remember on the CT side here of Dust2 as well, and Mouse Sports are getting blown out the water. Now, friend Sniper keeps on delivering on all fronts here. This second shot was just beautiful. Straight to the dome. Carragher didn't see it coming. Look at the movement go as well. And, of course, pulls out the Desert Eagle, makes it extra snazzy to close things out. Goodbye, Frozen. And it will be a very... Mayan, a bit of confidence from the young man here. I like the idea, but oh, goodness, Jesus. this is a weird... Train now, he could try and contest. They're gonna push together. Voxix oh. going up the ladder and he's got so much damage done. It's frozen ice in his veins. Three frags to his name. Kenny, however, standing his ground. 2v2. Bomb down and in favor of G2. Frozen up on the ladder. Oh. That's insane. Excuse me, I'm sorry about that. that. That's a bit much. <laughs> You're gonna have an ace on the agenda here. And Nexa. He'll be behind E-Box. Full Diffuse certainly available. Frozen's going to have to go for it. And now we will see if Nexa oh. can convert the spray. Looks like he's done enough here. Frozen's still on for the ace. He's running out of time. He's he has to go for the full Diffuse. He jumps up again. Is oh, it going to be as good? It's he's good. It. It's going to be close. I think he's done it. The ace clutch from Frozen. Oh, oh I can't believe oh, it. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry for anybody listening with headphones. <laughs> my ears did explode yeah. a little bit. I've got to set the maximum volume over here. Yeah, and that's... Just, an involuntary uh, sound. My brain. Yep, I'd like to apologize. <laughs> Thanks very much, Frozen, though. The first two were lovely. Picking up the third as Aminate gets the bomb down. That advantage needs lower than not getting the helmets. The M4 can actually put out more DPS if you get like the rate of fire. On. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, I don't know if there's a massive amount of science behind that, but sometimes in the T-Tide, it just feels good. You know, you feel quite nimble. And, and also, you, spray you, you know, you're kind of rubbing the salt in the wound as you kill them with their own weaponry. Supposed to be a disadvantage, oh! not for Kenny S though with this AWP. He's gonna get another Hello. one. Frozen just steps up, puts his head in the guillotine. And now Rops, he's got a one versus five handed to him by Kenny S. Well, round over. And Jax will find the opening towards B. That could win the round. Oh, so could that though. Chris J with the Mac 10 does pull one back. Frozen six HP, Carrigan. He rotates towards B now. Real awkward round now for G2. I think they've still got it in them. And oh, oh, my, my God. God, Frozen. He'll take the AWP to make that 6 HP less of an issue. The bomb is in his hands, and he can find Jax as well. It started with USPs, but it finishes with Frozen and Chris both finding two kills. Chris will take the Impact Player Award. Let's see that again. This is Frozen pushing towards spawn and dropping the bomb, essentially winning the round. Amazing timing there from Frozen. The fact he gets the AWP as well. Look at the awareness. Looks all those double doors just sitting and waiting. He knows the kill's coming to him. The bomb's down in T-spawn, bear in mind. And Jack's got that previous kill towards the B bomb. You need to be able to refrag that position. You need to be able to refrag those kills, but Twist played it perfectly. Trying to stay alive, forcing the 1v1s, not giving them the opportunity to get the kill back on to him. Look at this push. Tatsun rushes straight in towards the A side. I think they want to just take the site in full force, but they might not be able to. Twist is there yet again, and so is Liege. Oh my mm. god, an absolute slaughter to finish off the game. 16-7 to 7 in favor of Liquid. And we now have to just wait to see what their fate will be going forward in the road to Rio. Of course, there is other streams going on. If you haven't already... Professor, Fator Surpresa, se vai. 1x2, Fernando Alvarenga, a Dona Morte versus Cacerata Henrique, round difícil. Nossa, olha a Molotov, velho. Nossa, velho. <risos> Porra, filho. Acabou a Molotov, velho. Eu não sei. Eu... É. Нажми Нави сразу на точку, выйди на размен, все это могло бы закончиться очень круто. А тут смотри, и бомба в сотке, и красавцы на зелени выходят, правда, 
Правда, вот все очень быстро заканчивается для них. Кикер сразу же вшивает в две спины 3 секунды до конца, но меньше 20 секунд. Вот что мотивации ты раз Я пирдоле пато. Нуж нормальный, курва. Разумеешь? Нуж. Зак бук пагокнут. Mish's crystal will shatter, switches it back out to a USP, so we can actually play from range towards long. And it's just on Zen and Michaelele. They're both really teetering on a knife's edge. They eventually do swing out, but Michaelele is gunned down by Sergei, but it all falls into the hands of Zen. Will he be calm enough to clutch this one? Jump spotting, suspects there could be a player towards Gandalf, paranoid about where Alu could be as well. Makes his move up on towards the site, trying to rapidly clear his angles, does spot him and land that bullet straight onto him. But the plant is designed specifically so that Alu can clutch this one and walk away with it. The spam's a bit awkward. He is getting the defuse off. Stots, he's run oh. out of ammo. Oh no! <laughs> That is the This most... is the problem of when you play black bars, Jack. Uh, those pixel shots are so difficult. I play back black bars myself. I know how hard those shots are to land. It's like you're squinting with your eyes. Just hey, with Furia taking down the MIBR side, there are two spots up in danger. Envy and MIBR. If Envy are able to take this Mirage map, then they will rise to second place and push MIBR off of the top three position. If Bad News Bears are able to take this map, then Envy will remain in fifth position and MIBR will stay alive into the playoffs. For this final map, I'm the Eternal J. I'm your broadcast commentator. I'm joined by Dwayne for this one mates how tense could you get at this stage yeah, you couldn't really get any more по идее вообще без шансов сейчас все закончится но тут инфа 2b в этот момент ну давайте посмотрим красный второй хорошо кикер здесь дорезает тот же бомба not far off from opening that one up but Jax comfortable in the corner and supported by Kenny tries to jump across Foxy's got Jax locked in he loves his flash setups. He's pushing on this. Catches Jax oh. and gets the shot. Voxic, stunning. Unfortunately for him, though, his teammates bait the corner. If he gets this one as well, these oh. moves from Voxic are blowing me away. He could take this. Just blind him. Nice, man. AV behind six. Nice bait. Yeah, he must be with off, but... Oh my god. Peace. This is why I need to be in Australia. Rotation, so... Yeah. Ooh, look at this buy from Chris J as well. He could have forwarded uh, absolutely everything to go for him. Quick run, boost is perfect. Oh, hello. Like that is those ones. so satisfying to watch. Well, Ross. I, I was going to mention they've got no helmets and Chris J's Mac 10 can do all the work here. It might have been better just throw... Yes, if WP wins now the round, it's a chance to win the card. Train, bomb on B. Now it's going to be from one player. Booster again. They do it again. They turn around. And they already found the entry kill. No help here. Booster takes the booster. In this moment, perfect. Perfect. Solo. Try to take the base B. They already got it. Spot dog. Kicker takes the perfect. 4 in 2. Navi in minus. Вот это под. И вроде бы очень нужно выбить авики сейчас, очень нужно. Но с другой стороны сейчас потеряешь там 2-3 девайса, тоже будет тебе неприятно играть дальше. Но нужно это делать. Что сделали Virtus.pro? Они сделали помимо фейка, они все-таки выпустили бустера под дымы. Как в свое время, в первой половине это сделала команда Na'Vi. Там Запусти фейлика, да. Да-да-да, и тогда зашевелилась атака. И вот здесь Virtus Pro наконец. Got back onto the site. Any utility? Yeah, a whole lot of smokes. This is looking better for Mouse already. Closing the gap. They want to use perhaps Christian as a sacrificial lamb. He's refusing, and the spray it does connect. Carrigan gets knocked off it. Another drops in. Rob's keeping him safe. Hunter's got to get him oh. off, and he does. 
One last body there, it's frozen, it. and he does have enough time. My God, a massacre all over the construction site. <sighs> <laughs> HR, they've got a nightmare on their hands, but Mouseport's fine for. Well, it wasn't the prettiest retake, but it certainly was fun to watch. Mouseport's battling two for nail there inside the smoke. Absolute pandemonium there. No one was sure who's going to win the round, but it will be frozen with a full defuse there, spraying them down. Hunter finding kill after kill. They were trying multiple defuses here, but frozen finally gets the upper hand, and we go eight to four. Bomba pod B, they try to fake it, guys, but they don't have to be anywhere. Navi, but they just took the simple. Да, стянули сейчас на четвертом на точку А. И вот, возможно, бомба успешно выйдет, заберет перфекта и будет установлен, и раунд будет еще выигран. Да, тут один перфект за поп-догом остается, пока план работает. Плюс еще интри килл добивает капитан Virtus Pro. Второй минус добывает размен по Санжи. И бомба выходит практически в пустой бэплент. Осталось просто за поп-догом посмотреть соперника. А верх не прикрыл. Поверить. Ну, бомба поставлена была. Ну, Джейм сразу же, да, ответил и в итоге вышелкнул. Перфекты, перфекты вынужден был топать, ну вот можно было и до конца играть ну, шифтом и сыграть в последний момент, как-то помочь тиммейтам. Теперь, конечно, и шансов на выбивание не остается, потеряв перфекты на планете, только какая-нибудь роковая ошибка от команды Virtus.pro здесь может позволить взять Na'Vi 15 ну и уйти на сейф было бы весьма справедливым, справедливым решением. Супер качественно закрутили здесь ВП своих соперников, там Адрен сыграл жестко. Sí, como si ganaran mucho malo. Bueno, vale, sí. Venga, nenes. Estáis ya tranquilitos, ya. Mamá os va a dar colacaito porque yo diga que soy malo. Venga, chavales, ¿queréis? Venga, yo soy malo. Venga, ya. Ya estéis contentos los nenes, ya os podéis mamá preparar colacaito, ¿vale? Venga. Ya, ah, y el chupo de camino para los nenes chiquetitos, ¿vale? Que venís para acá. A nacer el gilipollas. ¿Vale? Aquí tenéis chupito vuestro. Off with a bang, Vossig looking towards T spawn and trying to find the opening kill if possible. They'll be on the CT side now. I've got two HD grenades. That's between Carrigan and Frozen as Jax. He'll be taken out towards Long. Tries to crack it open by himself. And now Chris J, who's probably got a frag available at this very same point. Wow. Oh. <laughs> Don't see many Barely even surviving that one. They pepper spray him through the smoke. They're gonna push up. They want IV control and they want to take it heavy handedly and rule of an iron fist into the round. Hauzuk leads the charge to take the T's out and he'll be taking out CT's as well. Hitting him with the height of his AK for our Hess as he swings wide. He oh, swings fast and ferocious, gunning them all down with the Kalashnikov and securing another round into the. Okay, now here Yaz will be on the electric. Okay, okay. I'm going to be on the electric. Okay, okay. What the hell is this? This is normal. We're going to be on the pop. Actually broken financially in some cases, but they do manage to get AKs one more time. Here's the run boost. You can see how beautifully done this was. No even jump required. Straight into it, and a flashbang goes over the top as well. He's actually blind as well. So Carrigan throws the flashbang as they're doing the run boost. There, a lot of pressure, Chad. The nail, the front, the jump on the first go. Yeah, and that's why we don't see it too much within the pro circuit because that margin for error, you fall. You just yeah. uh, you're giving away an entry killer that. Thirty out. <laughs> They are not letting go of W. Look at this. He's got no Hunter's idea. Hunter's way ahead of the scope. He's in Gandalf. He's still not got the frag. Finally, he will exploit the Woxic Orb. Amonex holding the flank. He nearly adjusts in time, but Rops and Frozen, their whereabouts are now known. And G2, they can plant safe. Yeah, oh, nice. they're planning for long. Nice long plant coming through. There, there shouldn't be a world to give this one up. You never know. Kenny S jumps up. Does spot one towards CT spawn. Yuri, he might get a quick mop here if he decides to push on out. And here it comes. That's the duel. Huge shot from KNG. It's a start. Forces the rebuy. They're going to boost KNG up. They're just setting him up for success here. This might catch Ken Henny off guard. If he gets up onto that, yes. Yes, on the balcony. This is such a good peek. Henny's holding this lower angle. If he jumps across one more, they seize him on the flash. And oh no, a missed shot. Maybe squandering their chances now. Furs looking a bit panicked. KNG, however, has hit another one. Three in the round. It was an eco and one second to spare. He gets the bomb down. K Serato looking to dig Fury out of this hole. And Art or finds all of them. It's a little bit better. And now the hit. Well, it's going to come in any second. Good smoke. Let's play around it. But a gap in there. There's a second to come. 
So the AK have frozen the flashbang from Vox and Carrigan has been set up for the big spray down here, but he catches the flash himself. He's got that first kill on Hunter. There's 10 seconds remaining. It's going to be down to Nexa to try and get the plan down. I don't think he's got a chance here. Carrigan's done so well, and he manages to get all the kills required, four in total, and now Swat's right back in this map now. 10 to 8, and money is shattered on the G2 side. Do you see the difference in the way that like Na'Vi would do their own type of strat versus the way that other teams do it? Now, obviously, this wasn't G2 going straight into it because it would have been a long rush, right? They would have used all the flashes, they would have got long control, they would have secured that, and then they would have had multiple sets of smokes to throw on. Connector in a... Goes all the way in towards Connector inside and robs with a beautiful shot. That's Kenny S going down, a bit of aggression there towards Ivy. Smoke is down, and now Manek to defend. One, and maybe oh. two. It's actually going to be Hunter. He's out. Chipping away on one of them, but Rops will claw it back with a sensational second. This is why they give him the P250. Four kills. Rops has won this round on his own. Mm, that's beautiful. Frozen, he gets given a P250 as well. They give their stars of the show exactly what they need. Well, there it is. Rops delivering on all fronts here. It was a P250 shot to kick things off. Aggression for Kenny S. And then it seemed like GG had some footing into the round, but apparently not. Rob's just finding absolutely every head and that's going to be kicking them off in the right direction here. It's going to be some sort of force by the imagine from G2. And yes, is it ever.